Hi everyone. Uh, to start off, I would like to pass my cap down to a junior, Amelia Sternschutz. Uh, Amelia has always been there for me to lend a hand, give advice, or simply just offer up a laugh. She's such a hardworking student, and I can't wait to see all of the great things that she accomplishes in the next few years. Best of luck on being a senior, Amelia. Next, I'd like to offer my gown to everybody who has helped me get to where I am today and helped me graduate. Uh, so first is my family for somewhat obvious reasons, but most importantly for never failing to believe in me, who I am, and support my dreams. Lori and Trent for being the best friends that anybody could ever ask for. Um, and for all of the memories that make it so hard for me to leave in the fall and go off to college. Mrs. Rupert for truly enriching my love for biology and medicine um, and always going the extra mile to make Doan feel like home to me. Mrs. Trosco for helping me when I was at my absolute worst and then being right there next to me to cheer me on when I was at my best. And of course, Mr. Gibbons for always helping to put a smile on my face, brighten my day, and never failing to have a good story to tell. Thank you so much for all that you guys have done for me in the short two years I was at Doan. Um, I'm so thankful to have had you guys in my life and I'm really gonna miss you all. Hello, my name is Lori Hendricks and today I'm going to be passing down my cap and gown. Being at Doan Academy for 13 years has meant that I've made a lot of great connections with a lot of great people. As I approached senior year, I kind of had an idea of who I would give my cap to, you know, which junior had meant the most to me. I found this out through crew. There was one girl in my boat in particular who reminded me a lot of myself. When you're on a sports team, you know, I feel like a lot of older members of the team have this experience of finding someone who means a lot to them and finding someone who they feel like has a lot of potential and for a minute there I was a little nervous that I wouldn't find someone who was like that until I met Delora. I watched her grow as a rower and as a person and I saw in her things that I once saw in myself. Determination, always getting back up there, making sure that her team had what they needed from her and I think that's why she made such an impact on me. So to Delora, I'm giving you my cap. For my gown, there were a lot of people who, you know, fit the criteria of meaning a lot to me throughout my time at Doan. And I really had to whittle it down to people who I felt like I truly made a connection with. So first would be my parents and my sisters and my family. You know, you guys have always been there for me um, at the end of the day through thick and thin. There's always those people, you know, you guys are always the people that I can count on. Next would be my best friend Jess. Um, I did recently write her an affirmation, so I'm not going to go into like all the reasons why I love her. You know, Jess, she showed me what a best friend really was in a time where I really needed one. And I feel like we both really connected that way. And even though I've only known you for about like 10 months, feels like I've known you my whole life. Next would be the boys, um, Trent, Husson, Richard, Nick, Nick Kern, and Douglas. I never expected myself to be friends <laughs> with you guys, as I know it sounds kind of mean, but I, I just never thought that you guys would be the ones that I ended up making a connection with senior year. I thought my senior year would be short, I mean it was cut short, but I thought it would be, you know, lonely and quiet, and you guys made it, you know, one of the best years of high school and so memorable and you know all the nights and times that we've all spent together and the fires and the talking and you know, just being there for each other in hard times and always there for the good times too meant a lot to me. Mrs. Rupert, you've been like a second mom to me. Last year was a tough year for me personally and Miss Rupert was someone who was there for me every step of the way and for that I thank you. Next we're gonna switch gears into the crew world. Coach Tom and Mr. Van Skyver. I came to you guys at a point in my life where I was told that I wouldn't be able to play sports again and then I found crew. You know you guys trained me to be the best athlete that I could be and the best leader that I could be and without you guys and teaching me how to row and teaching me how to cox and teaching me how to be you know a real team player I don't know what I would be doing you know I definitely wouldn't be on a college team right now. Mr. Van Skyver you've been with me in the ambulance and you've you know, seeing me through some of the best times. And Coach Tom, you've always been there to put a smile on my face even when I'm not feeling it at six in the morning. So thank you for that. Tim Nerveza, you are the funniest person I know. And without you, I'm sure I would have quit crew a long time ago. 
but um, you showed me the ropes and you were there to be funny when I was upset and you were there to not judge me at six in the morning on a Saturday when I looked like the worst person in the whole world and you were there through all of it. You've seen me throughout my entire rowing career and you've always made it the, some of the best memories of my life. And next is Evan. Evan, you you were my mentor and you were at a point, you know, the person who taught me everything I know about crew, quite frankly. Uh, when I joined the team, Evan had just graduated and he spent so many hours over the summer trying to teach me and bickering with me like a sibling and you know, I, I do know at the end of the day that you're always going to be someone who I can ask for advice, you know, whether it's crew related or not, and someone who's always going to be there, and I'm excited to maybe see you at some regattas, um, but thank you for that, and I'm excited, hopefully, if we get to row together this summer, because I've, I've gotten a lot better, I have, I have. So uh, now I'm going to wrap it up by saying that, you know, over 13 years at Doan, I've made a lot and a lot of connections, you know with lower school teachers, with friends, with middle school teachers. And, you know, even if we aren't that close anymore, I do want to say thank you for raising me into being such an amazing person that I've grown to become. And, you know, you really impacted me in a way that I cannot say thank you enough for. So on that note, everyone stay safe, stay healthy, and hopefully we will see each other again soon. First, I'd like to start by giving my cap to Reggie my favorite junior as well as my best friend. Reggie, it's gonna be difficult not having you around next year. You're one of the only people who can really make me laugh and the best shoulder I have to cry on. And I'm gonna miss you the most out of everyone. Okay, mom and dad. I would like to give you two my gown, firstly, for always being so supportive of everything I do, um, whether it's playing tennis or coming to my flute concerts or just buying me food at inconvenient times. You guys have always been there for me and I couldn't be more thankful. Thank you so much. We love you, darling. Thank you. I would also like to give my gown to Tomi and Bella, my two best friends. Um, over the years, you guys have always been with me through thick and thin, especially um, when I was at my lowest points, and you guys have always encouraged me to come back to the Layla that you know. And I will never forget that, and I'll always appreciate it, so thank you guys. Um, next, I would like to talk about all of my family members who unfortunately will not be able to be with me for my graduation as we had planned and I hope that I will be able to see you guys um, as soon as possible. Mrs. Mazar, um, <laughs> I'm giving you my gown for always being not only a talented and patient teacher but also such a great friend. You've helped me discover one of the best gifts I will ever know and that is playing my flute and I couldn't be more thankful for that. And Reggie, you get my gown as well because you're family. Hello, um, this is Richard. Um, for my cap, I would like to give it to Manav who has been a great president and a great friend. And also I would like to give it to Trent Post, Connor McHugh, um, Hassan for being there for me. They're uh, the closest friend I ever got. And it's really been an honor to um, study with them and hang out with them. And they appreciate Hassan for letting us in his basement to party and do all kinds of fun stuff. And for my gown, I would like to, of course, give it to my parents and, and also Mrs. Mrs. Mazar for being such a wonderful, wonderful uh, music teacher who really led me through all kinds of difficulties, uh, regardless uh, musical or not. 
Um, and also I would like to give my gown to Mr. Russell, who has, um, who has been really strict to me, I would say, and but in a good way. Uh, he taught me a lot of things, not just engineering mechanics, but also how to be responsible for myself. And he showed me how on um, the potential I got inside of me. And I am really grateful for that. And thank you. Hi, I'm Grace. I'd like to give my cap to one of my bio buddies, Izzy, and to my favorite person, Amelia. Um, you guys both always make me laugh and smile and just brighten up every one of my days, so thank you. Um, then I'd like to give my gown to my parents and my brother, Brooke, for their never-ending support and love and encouragement. Um, I definitely wouldn't be where I am today without you guys, and I love you. Um, I'd also like to give my gown to Miss Rupert and Mr. Russell for helping me through everything and just being great, being a great support system and amazing teachers. And I'd also like to give my gown to my amazing friends, um, Emily, Elena, Erin, and Quinn. I'm so lucky to have found such an amazing group of people to surround myself with and encourage me and love me. So yeah. Um, <laughs> thank you all for making in impact in my life and I love you all really hey very everybody. much. I uh, hope everyone's doing all right. Uh, for my cap, I'd like to give it to my co-counsel, my co-worker, and my future vice president, Manav. Uh, I'd like to give my gown to all my friends, uh, Connor, Trent, Zach, Nick Kern, Nick Calavito, Haley, Tommy, Richard, and Bella. I'd also like to give it to my parents and I, finally, I'd like to give it to all the teachers who helped me through my education at Doan. Ms. Mazar, Mr. Gibbons, Lombardi, and Ms. McCormick. Thank you guys. It's Haley Chen and I'm passing caps and gowns to Shannon Newman. I'm passing my cap down to Warren because all of our experiences during LFF and the same around school is always a memorable moment for me. I'm passing my gown down to my family and faculty and staff for all that they helped me with through the years. Let me be who I am and support me all. For my cap and gown, I'd first like to give my cap to my best friend, Lovey Sanchez, um, who's been my best friend for the past four years. I'm super grateful for you and everything that you and your friendship has taught me. Um, I appreciate you and I love you. Next, I'd like to give my cap to Sean Congleton, someone who I got close to um, at the beginning of my junior year at a time where I really needed that and you. So I appreciate that and um, how ever since then you've pushed me to be a better athlete. A lot of what's happened um, this season, I owe to you. So thank you again. Um, Reggie Daly is one of the if not the funniest person that i know i know we just got close this year but i'm super grateful for you and how much you make me laugh um and next marie sproul who is like my sister i love you so much and i appreciate how um especially now you keep me entertained every day and you're here for me all the time i appreciate that about you and how selfless you are um and the next is sophia oliver um i consider you like my little sister i could not have gone through the beginning of this year without you and i appreciate how um much you express how grateful you are for me i want you to know that i'm super grateful for you um and yeah then next is miriam samoye um someone who i started my high school career with um I could not have gotten through that freshman year without you. Um, you're like my big sister now and you teach me so much about myself and um, who I wanna become each day. 
And lastly, I'd like to give my cap to Caden Easy, who, um, again, left me this year, but is and always will be family to me. You're like my little brother, and you've been here for me um, more than most people, so I appreciate you a lot, and I love all you guys. And my gown I'd like to dedicate to my family, so my mom, my dad, my brother Nick, um, my aunt and uncle, and my three cousins, Pascal, Jeff, and Caleb. Um, my brother, I'm super grateful for you, Nick. I'm super grateful for everything you've taught me, how hard you've pushed me, and how strong that's made me. Um, we've been through a lot together, and I cannot have done it without you. I appreciate who you are and um, how that has taught me so much about myself and how you will always have my back and you know that I will always have yours. Um, my dad, I appreciate who you are and a lot of the sacrifices that you've made for me and how much you provide for me and how much you let me know that you love me and you always will. Um, that's All of that has taught me so much about myself and um, has made me stronger. And again, my mom has sacri sacrificed everything for me to get me here to keep me here and um is one of the most compassionate selfless kind people that i know and i want to emulate all of who you are when i'm older um you're the greatest mom so i thank you and i love you and my aunt slash godmother is like my second mom and has sacrificed so much not just for her own kids but for me and nick as well um just being an essential worker and putting your life on the line each day um just emulates again all of who you are and how much you're willing to give up to keep others safe and healthy and happy and my uncle who is like my second dad who spoils me and lets me know how much he loves me and i'm super grateful for you super grateful for everything that you taught me driving parallel parking um you and pascal who is my older cousin um and has been protecting me and watching out for me ever since i was a baby giving me the nickname that um my whole family calls me um i appreciate you and i love you same thing goes for jeff who's like my bodyguard um everybody knows that again one of the funniest people that i know and caleb who's my little brother and who i'm so proud to see grow up each day um all of you guys every single person that i um, dedicated my cap to and my gown to each of you has gotten me to where i am i'm super grateful for the impact that you've all had on my life and you're all really special to me so thank you hello everyone hope everyone's doing well and staying safe at home i want to start by giving my cap to a deserving junior whose perseverance and determination helped us win a cross country season. Brian Bateri, I really admire your determination to do well this season. I know it was hard, but you really stepped it up and helped us win. I'd like to give my gown to the people who've influenced me most in my time at Doan. To start, my parents. My parents have always been there for me and supported me in anything I wanted to do. And next, I'd like to thank my teachers Ms. Mazar and Mr. Lombardi, who guided me throughout my time at the school. And last but not least, my friends, Trent, Nick Cavito, Nick Kern, Hassan, Zach, Richard. You all have shown me what true friendship is, and I hope we continue to make more memories in the future. Tommy and Lucianapo. First, I'd like to thank God for helping me to get this far. I'd like to dedicate my cap to Ayanna Hawley, Aiden White, Alicia Reed, Jada Coleman, Jean Redman, my sis Tamara Mbeche, Danielle Nerveza, Gwen Wells, Colin Custer, and Nadia Boyer. I love you guys and good luck with the rest of high school. I'd like to dedicate my gown first to my family. 
To my parents, thank you for every single thing that you've done for me. Thank you for all the car rides, to practices, games, open houses, concerts, everything, and for providing for my future. To my sisters, I love you both, and you're both the greatest sisters in the world. To the rest of my family, my grandparents, my uncles in New Jersey, my uncles in Union, and his family, my uncle and aunt in Texas, and my uncles, aunts, and cousins in the UK and in Nigeria. Thank you to each of you for loving me and supporting me. Second, I want to dedicate my gown to my close friends, Sky Tree, Harry Kumar, Layla Daly, Bella Trimble, Ali Chen, and Nick Kern. Thank you for all the inside jokes and the fun memories, and I miss all of you. Lastly, I'd like to dedicate my gown to the following faculty and staff members and teachers. Miss Sieb, Mrs. Trosco, Miss Musella, Miss Tessa, Miss Tynan, Mr. Cook, Mr. Newman, Mr. Russell, Mrs. Mazar, Mrs. Branwood, Miss Hall, and Mr. Tangling. Thank you for all of your love and support and for helping me throughout my entire high school career. Thank you to everyone at Doan for all of your love and support. I appreciate all of you. Hello, Doan Academy community. Today I'll be announcing who I'm giving my caps and gowns to. Today I'd like to give my cap and gown to three juniors. The three juniors I'll be giving my cap and gown to are Matt Fister, Warren Bernard, and Marion Halasa. Even though I've only known them for three years, it feels like it's been a really long time. I've gotten to know these juniors through playing sports and other activities. Whether from whether it was playing soccer with Warren, playing basketball with Ryan, or hanging out with Matt in the summer, we all had lots of fun experiences and those are experiences that I'll cherish and never forget. Hi, my name is Isabella Turnbull and I'm excited to be graduating from the class of 2020. I would like to pass my cap down to Shreya Oganda, who I've known for three years. You are always so kind in helping others and I really admire that. Thank you for helping me in class. You are such a hard worker and motivated and I know you're going to be very successful in college and after. I would like to give my gown to my family because they have always been there for me and supported me through everything. I know they will always love me and be there for me whenever I need it, and I know I will be, do the same in return. I'd also like to give my gown to Nancy Kurt, my tennis coach, because she has helped me improve as a player and as a person. I, I will miss our seasons and games and your delicious end of the season dinners that we always have. I'd also like to give my gown to my three best friends, Layla, Tommy, and Hassan. Thank you guys for always being there for me whenever I need it. I will miss seeing you guys every single day in class, and I know you guys will be very successful in college and after. This, this chapter of my life is closing, but I am excited for what's ahead at my future college, Stockton University. Thank you, Doan, for everything. I would like to pass my cap to my parents for being there to support me throughout my entire high school. And I'd like to pass my gown down to my good friends, Sabina Osterman and Sadi Gomez. Hi everyone, it's Nick Kern. I would like to give my cap to Emily O'Connell for being the best girlfriend a guy could ask for. And to Ryan Halassa. Even though we haven't hung out in the past few years over high school, I feel like I've kind of grown up with you and I can't wait to see all the cool things you'll do in the future. I hope we stay friends. I would like to give my gown to my parents, my grandma, pop up and Nana, and my uncle Mike for all of their love and support. I would also like to give my gown to Mr. Russell and Mr. Bonick for always being there for me and making me laugh. Also, I would like to give my gown to Miss Branwood for being an amazing teacher these past four years. To Miss Mazar for pushing me to my limit and making me the best version of myself. And to Mr. and Mrs. Gorman for letting me play piano at your wedding and for taking me on amazing performances uh, at Canada at the theater festival. I would like to give my gown to Trent Post, Nick Calavito, Connor McHugh, and Hassan Pirali for being an amazing group of friends these past four years. To Aaron Schrager for being an amazing friend. To Ariana Clue for being the coolest person I know and the best 
junior class vice president and to Tommy Wow for being the kindest and nicest friend I could have. Thank you. This is Emily Myers' cap and gown video. This is my like 10th take doing this. So I'm gonna try this time to make it really short. Um, I'm gonna give my cap to two juniors. Uh, first, Emily O'Connell, who has been like a sister to me, um, both in family and also uh, accepting that I basically live at her house. So <laughs> thank you for that. Um, and second, Mackenzie Cardis, who, while being the quietest in the art room, is one of the most talented and everyone is very aware of that. Um, they just have to look at your work. Um, and you're both super hardworking people and I'm really excited uh, for when I visit next year to see all the great things that you guys are adding to both the school and specifically um, Studio and Kaminati. Um, second is my gown <laughs> and I have a lot of faculty so I'm just gonna list them all first. Uh, Mr. Van Skyver, Mr. Russell, Ms. McCormick, Mr. Fisher, and Mr. Bonick. Um, I'm sorry, I'm gonna make it quick, I promise. Mr. Van Skyver has been like a second dad to me. Mr. Russell is the greatest advisor that anyone can ever have. Everyone else will agree with that in my advisory. Um, Ms. McCormick is very scary at first, and I was very scared of her, and now she's one of my favorite teachers, and we talk all the time, even out of the classroom. Um, then, Mr. Fisher um, is <laughs> very funny. Um, I love all of our conversations that me, him, and Miles have, and have had for the past four years in art, and he's made me realize my potential um, because he's really pushed me to work harder. Um, and then Mr. Bonick, who everyone will agree is the best addition to Doan Academy. And he makes everyone so happy. And not only has he been a great teacher, but also kind of like a second advisor to me. And um, just a really great person who always listens to his um, students and makes it very evident that he wants to be there for everyone. Um, so thank you to all of my teachers at Doan who have really shaped me and have taught me so much and I'm gonna take it all with me to college um, because I'm a better person because of all of my teachers. Um, then I have my family, um, my parents who have always pushed me to be 100% myself and have always taught me to speak out and never pushed me to be someone who I'm not and uh, let me have my own values and beliefs. And that's very um, evident to who I am as a person today. Um, so thank you so much for supporting me through everything that I've ever been through the past 17 years. Um, my siblings, Matthew, Ryan, Adrian, my two sister-in-laws, Sam and Monica, and my niece, Maggie. I love you all so much. And being an only sibling would be really, really boring. And I would be very different. Um, having brothers is great. And then getting sisters in my life too is amazing. And having a niece um, after so long of begging for one um, is amazing. And I love you all so much. Um, and then lastly is Jason O'Connell, who has been my best friend for the past two and a half years. Um, you've been there with me through Doan and then just life in general. Um, and then of course, my all my friends, my senior friends, but they don't need my cap and gown because they have their own. But um, everyone who I just talked about has impacted me so much. And I'm really appreciative for having all of you in my life because the past four years have been very important years and I don't know what I would have done without all of my friends and my teachers and my family. So thank you so much, everyone. Um, uh, yeah, bye. Hi, um, my name is Quinn Canavan and 
this is going to be the video where I pass down my cap and my gown. I don't have either on me, but that doesn't make the sentiments any less real. Um, I am giving my cap to Evelyn Matthews. And there's a lot of reasons to this. Um, <laughs> but I have known Evelyn for as long as she's been a Doan. And that means I've known her since she was quite little. And when you know someone for that long, inherently you have this want for them to succeed really more than anyone else, I would say, um, because you've seen the way that they've grown and that they really do have the potential to do amazing things because when you've seen someone's past for that long, you can get a feel of the projection of their future. And... Evelyn, I've known you for many, many years, and we interact off and on, and when we do interact, it means the world to me, and I love you very dearly, and I hope that you know that you can always reach out to me, you know, always. I know that, you know, I know that it's hard sometimes, but I believe in you, so you get my cap because I love you and I'm here. My gown goes to a lot of people because I am fortunate enough to have had this insane network of love, I guess, the whole time that I've been at Doan, but especially these past four years. Um, and I have teachers specifically who I love very dearly and who I know want nothing more than for me to succeed. And those teachers are Miss Annie Hall, Miss Branwood, Mr. Bonick, and Miss McCormick. And these four people have known me for ranging on 13 years to only two. Um, but they each have had such a tremendous impact on my life and I would not be who I am today and I um, I might not even be here today um, if it weren't for these four people believing in me constantly and constantly pushing me to move forward. So thank you. And my gown also goes to my family, um, my mom, my dad, and my sister. And I can't explain the impact that these three people have had on me um, throughout my life, um, but I am grateful for it every day of my entire life, and I will be grateful. Continuing. Whoops. Um, so just... Thank you. Um, and that's really all. So for my cap, I'm going to call up Nick Scoofless, Manav Raval, Ryan Halasa, and Matt Fister. These guys have been some of my closest friends and baseball teammates over the past few years, and I'm thankful that I got the opportunity to get to know them. They've challenged me to become a better person and leader both in the classroom and out on the baseball field. I know we're all a little disappointed that the great baseball season we anticipated never got to happen. I'm a little sad. I'll never get to play high school ball with you guys again, but I'll never forget all that we learned about teamwork, trust, and leadership while being part of the Doan baseball team. So for my gown, I'm going to call on my family. It's my mom, my dad my sisters, Asha, Nadia, Marissa, and my brother, Aiden. Honestly, I don't know where I'd be without them. 
but they provided me with countless opportunities to grow as a person through all they've done. My parents have been to every game that me and my siblings have had, whether it be softball, baseball, or other various sports and activities. My parents were actually the ones who encouraged me to come to Doan, but I was pretty skeptical at first. I guess they're pretty wise for adults because once I realized how special this place was, I felt grateful that they gave me the chance to have the Doan experience. And I wouldn't trade all the moments I've made with my siblings for the world. Okay, hi. My name's Elena. Um, I don't have my cap or my gown, but I have a beach hat and a hoodie. So that's what we're working with here. Um, I'm, I'm gonna give my beach hat, okay, my cap to Delara Canturk because she is the funniest human being I've ever met. And we had Latin together and we would just make each other laugh all year. And she was like my favorite person ever. She is amazing and so funny. And I wish we had Latin again this year because it was so much fun. And then I'm giving my hoodie, aka my gown to my family, which is my dad, Michelle, my brother, Sophia, um, and also my four best friends, Aaron, Grace, Emily, and Quinn, because I love them so much and they have been my rock through this past year. And I'd also love to give my gown to Miss Franwood because she's helped me a lot through this year which has been challenging for me, and I just really appreciate all that she's done for me. So, yeah. One. So, I'm gonna be, tradition is you hand your cap down to a junior, but I couldn't decide, so I chose three. Um, I don't have pictures, but, well, what can you do? Um, I'm going to be handing my cap down to Sadi Gomez, Sabina Osterman, and Evelyn Matthews. So, you guys are amazing. Sadi, you are the funniest human on the face of this earth, and I love you to death. Sabina, you've been with me since my start at Doan, and a wo wonderful friend, and I cannot thank you enough. And Evelyn, we really got closer this year, and for that I'm thankful, because you are amazing. And to the three of you, my cap. my gown so for my to my gown I dedicate this to my family my parents my sister Brianna um, my grandparents and I dedicate it to all all, all all my friends who were with me on this awesome journey um, special thanks to Nick Kern Quinn Canavan Colin Monahan Eric Williamson and so many more. And for all of you, I am so, so, so incredibly thankful. So, thank you. Hi, it's Erin. I don't have a cap or a gown, so I'm going to be giving this to Malia for always making me laugh and always brightening my day and for just making advisory so much fun this year. And I would also like to give my cap to Miss Rupert for just being there for me all the time. And even if she wasn't here this year physically, um, she always reached out to me and made sure I was okay. So thank you for that. And I would like to give my gown to Mr. Bonnick and Mr. Van Skyver for always being there for me and always helping any way that they can and making sure that I was okay. And I would like to also give my gown to my four best friends, Quinn, Elena, Grace, and Emily, just for being so much fun and for always being there for me. And I would like to give my gown to my dad for always supporting me no matter what. And I love him so much. Hi everyone. First, I'm gonna pass my caps to Cisco Su, which is a great senior, 
and a great rapper and always has a sense of humor, then I'm gonna pass my gown to my family, which always supports me to study abroad and always trust me. Then my host mom always helps me and let me not feel lonely when I'm in a foreign country. My teacher, Mr. Gorman, always helps me and never give me up, although I'm not good at math. Miss Saradak helped, that's my first teacher. I met in Dawn and helps me a lot. My friend, Williamson, we always stick together for the last three years and thanks for being a great friend and thank you all. Bye. Hi everyone. I hope you're all doing well and staying safe during these crazy times. I wish we could do these together in person, but it's understandable why we can't right now. For my cap, I'm going to give it to this junior who has had a big impact on my life and I've grown to have a friendship with over my time at Dome. This junior, I've always admired their work ethic and determination to give 100% in everything they do. For my cap, I'm going to give it to Evelyn Matthews. Now for my gown, I'm going to give it to the people who have shaped me into the person I am today. For starters, that's my parents. They've, they've done everything for me and I'm, I'm beyond grateful that I have them as parents. And to my teachers, Ms. Rupert, Mr. Lombardi, Mr. Gibbons, Ms. McCormick, Ms. Mazar, Coach Dan, you know, you, you guys have helped me through my toughest times at school and I, I'm beyond grateful to have had you guys as teachers. And finally, for my best friends, uh, they're a group of guy, people that I've, I couldn't have asked for a better group of friends to go to high school with. It's Connor, Nick Kern, Nicole Vito, Jess, Husson, Lori, Zach, and of course, Doug. Well, I hope to see you all soon at graduation and stay safe out there. Ooh, okay. So never mind how the cap is on my head. This is very hard to put on. But anyways, I first, I wanted to start this video off by saying that there are a lot of you who have impacted my experience here at Doan and made it better. And there are so many of you to the point where I don't know if I'll be able to like acknowledge all of you in this video. And the fact that I have to do this over video and not in front of you all and be able to see your faces just makes it that much harder for me to remember. Um, just know that if we've talked or you um, know me personally, you would be getting my cap as well. So if I forget to mention anybody, do not take it personally. I still love you all. Um, it's just a matter if I'll be able to say everyone because, uh, but okay, I'm going to get into it. So first, I want to start off by giving my cap to Yadiselli Sproul, aka Marie, and Sean Coggleton. Um, I love, I have love for both of you and Marie. We've been really, we've been getting closer throughout these years, and I'm happy with how our relationship has blossomed and grown, and seeing you grow. So, I thank you for being a part of my don't experience. And Sean, um, we were really close at one point, and I'm grateful for the friendship that we had. Um, you're very funny, cool, <laughs> um, and really chill. And thank you to you as well for being a part of my Don experience. I also want to give my cap to a large number of people. Um, like I said in the beginning, if I don't mention your name, no hard feelings, don't take it personal. There's just so many of you and I love you all. Um, I want to also give my cap to my friends like Vitha, Maddie, um, Aaron, Aaron Schwager, and Aaron Doran, um, Nick Kern, Layla, Abdullah, Layla, Daly, Tony, Bella, Elisa, <laughs> um, Maliha, so many us. But yes, all of you have 
impacted me and you were all very near and dear to my heart and Levy can't forget Levy Levy Sanchez and yeah finally <laughs> I want to give my cap to Chris um Faye Matt um Brian on maintenance big Brian uh Chuck Pat Jeff Mr. Van Skyver and Zach and yeah those are basically all the people I worked with on the summer maintenance crew and I learned a lot over the summer working with you guys and thank you for Van Skyver for um thank you to Van Skyver for hiring me so I was able to gain those new experiences um but yeah I definitely learned a lot and I appreciate it all and all that you've done for me and all the laughs and stuff like that and yeah so my finally my cap goes out to the summer maintenance crew okay so lastly 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 i want to give my cap to the faculty and staff at Doan, who i've been able to confide in and look to for advice all of you have taught me so many things from topics and subjects to life lessons and give me advice about people and going on to college and basically how to act and maneuver in the world and I thank you all for that and I appreciate every little thing that you guys do. Um, Dylan really is a family vibe and you guys definitely add on to that. Some teachers off the top of my head are like Mr. Tingling, um, Mr. Cook, Mr. Bonick, Mrs. Dewey, Mrs. Rupert, Miss Hall, um, Mrs. Dempsey, the Gormans, uh, Mrs. Williamson, Coach Dan, Mr. Gibbons, um, there's just so many of you and I appreciate all that you've done for me and the rest of the senior class. Thank you. Okay, and now I'd like to give my gown to um, a couple of family members. You know the saying, it takes a village to raise a child. So I definitely want to give my gown to my village, which includes my godmothers, my godfathers family friends um <clears throat> all of that you guys have sacrificed a lot to raise me and make sure i became the beautiful smart young woman i am today and i appreciate all that you guys have put on the line for me especially my godmother donna williams who you all know very well she's been taking care of me since my mom passed so i want to say thank you to her um carol eddie Miss Mary, Miss Vanessa, Marsha, um, and there's just so many of you, Mr. Tori. I love all of you and thank you. I also can't forget my godfather, D. He's always checking up on us, um, making sure we're doing okay, me and Donna. And he's always asking what I need. So thank you, D, real name Darren. Um, we appreciate you over here. And I also can't forget my best friends outside of Doan who have been here since I even came to Doan. They're like sisters to me. Um, yeah, that's family for real. Thank y'all for supporting me through my support system, especially when my mom passed. I appreciate you guys. I love y'all from the bottom of my heart. But yeah, this also goes out to Deja Showers, Niaja Rogers, and Aaliyah Hunter. I love you guys. Also on that front, I'd like to give this gown Lastly, but definitely not least, to my friend Ryan Blazy. I've known him for about 10 years. He's like family to me now. It's like my guy best friend. I tell him I love him all the time. And but yeah, he genuinely cares about me and I appreciate him more than he knows. So once again, thank you to all friends, family, don staff, faculty, everybody um, for making these last four years and then some um, a ride just what a ride to be on and experience so yeah thank y'all okay so this is me after the fact editing the video and i just wanted to say bye <laughs>
as well as enjoying it with me. Love you guys forever, family for life. As for my gown, I'll be passing it down to my family who's supported me through my whole journey. My dad, my stepmother, Melissa, my three little sisters, and my grandma. No matter what, you guys never stop loving me and supporting me, and I love you all. Additionally, I'd like to mention the following faculty and staff who brought smiles to my face during my time at Doan. Mr. Cook, Ms. Bramwood, Mr. and Mrs. Gorman, Ms. Hall, Mr. Sanderson, Ms. Williamson, Coach Dan, and Coach Sean. I thank God for the wonderful opportunity I was blessed with to have met you all. God bless, love you all, and thank you. I would like to pass my cap and gown to Ryan Halasa. Ryan and I have been friends for about two years now, and this year I feel like we got closer, and I'm glad that I could call him one of my best friends, and I can't wait to see what the future holds. And I would also like to thank everybody that helped me get adjusted to Don Academy, being that this was my first and last year. So this was bittersweet, I would say, and I'm gonna miss it. And thank you for making this one of the best years of my high school career. Thank you. Congratulations to all the seniors. Hooray! Bye class of Kai Kai, we miss you. Okay. Say congratulations, seniors. Congratulations, seniors! Have a good summer and good luck in college. Have a wonderful day at home. Make sure you give your mommy and daddy a hug and kiss for all of us, okay? Bye. Mwah.